No, thanks. With a million majority already against him, and the church count is still to be heard from, I'm afraid we've got no choice. This one? That one. again. Is there anything... No, I... thanks, Mr. Bernstein. Better go home and get some sleep. You too. Good night, Mr. Kane. Alexander, don't bother. I'm not interested. I've set back the sacred cause of reform. Is that it? All right. That's the way they want it. The people have made that choice. It's obvious the people prefer Jim Geddes to me. You talk about the people as though you own them. So they belong to you. As long as I can remember, you've talked about giving the people their rights, as if you can make them a present of liberty, as a reward for services rendered. Jed. Remember the working man? I'll get drunk too, Jedediah. If it'll do any good. It won't do any good. Besides, you never get drunk. You used to write an awful lot about the working man. Oh, go on home. turning into something called organized labor. You're not going to like that one little bit when you find out it means that your working man expects something as his right, not as your gift, Charlie. When your precious underprivileged really get together, oh boy, that's going to add up to something bigger than your privilege, and I don't know what you'll do. Sail away to a desert island, probably, and lord it over the monkeys. I wouldn't worry about it too much, Jed. There'll probably be a few of them there to let me know when I do something wrong. Mm. You may not always be so lucky. You're not very drunk. Drunk? What do you care? You don't care about anything except you. You just want to persuade people that you love them so much that they ought to love you back. Only you want love on your own terms. Something to be played your way, according to your rules. Charlie, I want you to let me work on the Chicago paper. What? Well, you said yourself you were looking for someone to do dramatic criticism. Uh, criticism. I am drunk. <laughs> I want to go to Chicago. They're too valuable here. Well, Charlie, there's nothing left for me to do but ask you to... All right, you can go to Chicago. Thank you. Guess I'd better try to get drunk anyway. I warn you, Jedediah, you're not going to like it in Chicago. The wind comes howling in off the lake, and gosh only knows if they ever heard of Lobster Newberg. Will Saturday after next be all right? Anytime you say. Thank you. Toast, Jedediah, to love on my terms. Those are the only terms anybody ever knows. His own. <laughs> 